It's eerily quiet. No sign of Zephyr. You think they took him away already? What say we quit hiding and go ask some villagers? Someone's bound to report us no matter what we do, so we might as well. Hey, Shion! What? You heard her. She's got a point. Our cover was blown last night. Where's the sense in sneaking around? And what if there are soldiers lurking about? They would have followed us to the cabin already. Relax. The coast is clear. Let's hurry and speak to the villagers. Is she always like that? I don't know how you managed to put up with her. What makes you think I'm managing? Let's try talking to the villagers. <sighs> hey. I guess. Great! Messia 224. Now that's a weird name. Messia is basically a code. It indicates it's a small village. So it's not its actual name? Then does that mean that 224 is... Yeah. It's merely a serial number assigned to it for administrative purposes. So the Renans even get to decide what places are called out in this realm. You see anybody around here who could use our help? We can't chase up. After every little thing.
You're the friends of that man the Bureau agents took away. Please, leave us alone. We don't want any trouble. <gasps> Answer our questions and we'll leave you in peace. Where did the agents take our friend? S Sisloden. The capital. That's what they said. I knew it. What did we ever do to deserve this? We haven't even crossed the street without looking first. Why are they Shh. after us? Come on, we're wasting time. You'll need to hurry if you want to get your friend back. Not a single person who's been taken to Sisladin has ever returned. Hey, keep quiet! You're trying to get us all killed? How the hell with that? Go on, report me! See if I care! I thought this Sisladin was a city. Is it a prison camp? It's the realm's capital. Though when you're forbidden to move freely like we are, there isn't much difference. My parents and siblings were taken by the Snake Eyes. I haven't heard from any of them since. For all I know, they're long dead by now. Anyway, go! And kill as many Snake Eyes as you can for me while you're there! All right. To Sisloden it is. What's this thing? I wonder if something <sighs> happened. one of Hoodle's friends. I think there's someone in trouble here. Well, let's see what they have to say.
People are really terrified of the Snake Eyes. They've got them jumping at their own shadows. They may be Lord Ganabelt's lackeys, but for all intents and purposes, it's the Snake Eyes who control the realm. One wrong look, and your history. So Zephyr's being moved to Sisladin. Let's cross our fingers we catch up with him on the way. I mean, the plan was always for me to take you guys to Sisloden anyway. But a word of advice. Oh? There's a forest we have to pass through on our way there. I won't lie to you. It'll be dangerous. More Zugals? Wild ones at that. They hunt in packs led by the biggest, meanest one. My friends and I got cornered by one on our way to Calaglia. That's how we got split up. We'll just have to keep our wits about us then. The forest we're about to walk through is pretty dangerous. Let's make sure we're prepared before we go further. Rinwell, if you get injured, just let Xion know, okay? I only have one pair of hands, you know. This is great. The taste and aroma will blow everyone away. Shion. Could we talk a moment? And here I was, thinking I could get some rest. Is something the matter? The matter? No, no, nothing like that. Then if it's all the same to you, I'll be going to sleep, thanks. Is chatting with me really that much of a drag? I just don't get the point, that's all. Is there some pressing reason why we have to talk right now? I don't know, I just... I think we should all make an effort to get to know one another. What if there's an emergency? An emergency? What if one of us suddenly got sick? Then I'd cure them with my healing arts and we'd move on. That's easy for you to say. But for the person doing the asking, it may not be so easy 